I bet you're wondering where in America is Lydia now. Well, I am in St. Louis, where the Italian spirit is still going strong. You feel the crack in the pinch. Ah, there you go. You're Italian. Can I just get, get into it? Come and join me. The importance of the Italian table cannot be overstated, and in the United States, Volpi Foods has been filling the culinary needs of Italian-Americans for over a century. Originally founded by John Volpi in 1902, his nephew Armando Passetti learned the artisanal process of meat curing and eventually became owner, with his daughter Lorenza recently taking over the reins, making it a third-generation family business. I spoke with Armando about the many varieties of cured meats so important to Italian cuisine. Armando, bellissimo, come una rosa, grazie. just like a rose. Grazie mille, grazie. Ah, beautiful. These are all the products that you make here. Now, you know, I was eating your products when I first came as an immigrant here in 1958. The delicious prosciutto, the culatello you have, and then, of course, the salami which you make, and this is capocollo. Capocollo. Uh -huh. And these are the coppa, you know, the, the sweet coppa and the picante? Picante, sì. You know, I get a lot of questions about uh, coppa. What is coppa and how is it made? Uh, what is coppa? Coppa is the shoulder of the, of the pig, boned out, boneless shoulder, and then it's cured in salt and spices, and then it's stuffed in a casing and aged like, uh, like salami or prosciutto. And then it is now, ready. To... Now, what is the difference between dolce, sweet, and the picante? Uh, the, it's the same coppa, only the picante, we add, uh, we add the hot pepper and the paprika to make it a little hot, but only on the outside. On the outside, so. Because you cannot do nothing on the inside, it's a it's sour one piece, piece of, of meat. meat. It's right. one piece of meat. I am going to. Now, being the piece of shoulder, you know, the meat comes as it does, so you have this kind of strains of fat running through it. Yes, because uh, pigs are not all the same. Some copa are leaner and some are fatter. Than, uh, they're not all exactly the same, like you said. And, and how do you like to eat it the best? The best is to eat it uh, as, as an appetizer, like an antipasto, and also on sandwiches. It's great and, for sandwiches. I love it for sandwiches. And of course, I'm going to taste this one right now. Buona, buona, buona. Dolce, buona, sì. buonissima, buonissima, molto buona, bellissima. There is nothing like handmade Italian cured meats. I am so glad Volpi Foods is continuing the craft of authentic artisanal products in the United States.